guys, it's your girl Kirby Smoke, and I'm here to bring you a new review of Fumari's Blueberry Muffin. I'm so excited about this flavor because I've heard so many good things about it. Um, so many good things about the brand Fumari in general, how um, fresh it smells, how good it tastes, the everything, the smoke, just, I've heard it's a phenomenal smoke. And now, I got my new bowl, I got a Tangiers Pico, um, I know it's a little bit small, but I did it because when I do my reviews, a lot of the times I pick up 50 gram tins, and if I like it, then I want it to last a little bit, and I think the Pico holds anywhere from 10 to 20 grams, I can't remember completely, but I wanted to pick up a bowl that is going to make my 50 gram tubs last long, and any of the flavors that I like to smoke, but I don't have a lot of time to smoke a couple rounds on, I wanted something short. So, um... The directions on the back say to mix it. So before each use, squeeze the pouch to get the juices flowing to mix evenly with the tobacco. Which means that any Fumari that I get, um, I'm not going to be taking it out and putting it into the jars like I normally do with my other brands. Um, I also really like this. I like the fact that it's a resealable pouch, the the block in there. I really like that. It's different because everyone else has a can and this allows you to mix your tobacco thoroughly with the juices. I like that. Um, to pack it, you to just take your index fingers and pinch and sprinkle it in your bowl. Wrap it with foil and add the hot coal. Um, basically my foil pattern was just basic circles around with four circles in the middle because the Tangiers Pico is a funnel bowl, so um, it'll suck down. To smoke, inhale, exhale, repeat often as you like. Stash it, you seal it tight, and store it in a cool place. Don't forget the fridge is for food, not food for Mari. So you don't need to acclimate this. Okay. Um, so. Let's see. There's nothing really else to say about it. I love the branding. It's great. I love everything about it. So I'm going to go ahead and tell you what I smell. Instantly I get hit with a tart blueberry smell. It reminds me of a blueberry candy or a blue raspberry candy. It's definitely more blueberry than blue raspberry. Um, not really getting muffin flavor, but when I think about it, I think more about like a blueberry tart or blueberry pie, and I enjoy that smell very much. It's very sweet but tart, candy-ish but sour at the same time. It's very, to be very realistic of a blueberry. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get everything set, I'm going to load the coals on, and I'm going to smoke a little bit, and give you our opinion, and show you how it smokes. Alright guys, I'm back, and I'm going to show you guys my setup. So, I'm actually recording in my bed today, so this is why I can do this. Alright, so as you can see here, I've got my KM Cafe Mini, water in the base, my Tangiers Pico funnel on the top with two Coco Naras, and of course, my long-handled tonic Egyptian hose. I'm really digging this flavor so far. Um, this is the second time I smoked it. I would have smoked it more so far, but um, actually the smell bothers my roommate a little bit, and she's pregnant, so um, I try to not bother her when I smoke Kuka um, from my reviews. So I'm going to show you the clouds one more time. As you can see, they're nice milky clouds. They're nice and thick, white, perfect coloring. So, um, for the taste. Definitely getting the blueberry. The blueberry is very nice. Um, it smells strong in the pack. 
but um, the way that it tastes is a nice, mild, sweet blueberry with a little bit of tartness on the end. Um, when I exhale out of my nose, I get a little bit of that pancake muffin-like flavor, I guess. It, it just reminds me more of the blueberry muffin um, pancake in between that. Um, but when I exhale out of my mouth, I definitely still think of the, like a blueberry pie. So, um, but that's just me. I get different exhale and inhale. It's whatever. It's definitely very tasty. It's something that I would definitely purchase again. Um, Definitely not regretting my choice on picking it up. Um, about the smoke, actually that's the first time I've been able to blow smoke rings without my smoke going all over the place. So I definitely want to say that I think that this is probably a really nice thick smoke. Um, definitely ho Holds, definitely holds the shape of the O's that I've been blowing um, really, really well. Overall, I'm going to give it a 5 out of 5. It definitely has a nice blueberry smell and taste to it exactly what it says it is it's blueberry um even though it doesn't exactly taste like a blueberry muffin it does stay in the range of the blueberry desserts so that is why i'm going to keep it at a five out of five the smoke is great um i don't know anything about the buzz because i'm not getting one right now um but it tastes amazing it smokes amazing i would definitely recommend it to you guys to pick it up um, I know that Fumari is pretty pricey. It really is. It's about $9 for 100 grams, which is a lot for, um, most brands, but it is a very good quality smoke. I have no stems in the entire package that I got, so that's really nice. So, um, overall, the packaging is great. I love the fact that it's a Ziploc bag resealable. It's where I can keep my shisha nice and stored. I think it's a really high quality tobacco and I definitely like I said would recommend it to anybody to pick up so there you go